Hey guys, Austin here. Welcome to another mod showcase. And today I would like to show uh, the Plant Mega Pack mod. Now, some of you guys requested I do a bigger mod, and your requests have been granted. This is a huge mod that is basically designed to add in about, I would say, about 300 new plants into your world generation. Not to mention a ton of different, um, I wouldn't say furniture, but uh, like ladders, stairs, and all and doors, and decorative stuff like that to add into your Minecraft world, and also a ton of food as well. So, without further ado, let's get this mod showcase started. And before I do, let me just warn you, all these chests are filled, and not only are they filled, there's about probably two other double chests worth of this stuff, but I just didn't feel like throwing it all in, so I'm just going to show you like a, yes, you could say a preview of what's in the mod now. Remember, when I show you this, there's a lot more. In fact, let me just look. One, two, three, four, five different pages full of stuff. And so first let me just show some plants that are in this chest. So as you can see, we have some bamboo plants, some ivy plants, some flowers, some sweet pea plants, some that's a creeper. Japanese creeper plant. Um, I'm pretty sure this is every plant in the entire world by the looks of it, considering how much there is. Some Miller plants, foliage plants. You get the picture. Bamboo. Um, over here in the decoration area, we have a ton of, as you can see, ladders, different ladders made with the different recipes of the different bamboo and such. We have some planters, so if you want to plant some flowers, Here's the recipe to make a cobblestone planter. You get cobblestone, you put any kind of dirt right here, and some bone meal. So I guess it'll grow it instantly. If you want one of these square planters, you just put whatever material there. Soil, pot soil, whatever, and some bone meal. And as for the crafting recipes, the doors, they're all the same. As you can see, just with that type of wood plant thing. Same with the fences and the gates. And up here, there's these wall brackets. I'm not entirely sure what they're used for, but um, seem to be a work in progress at the moment because I don't seem to be getting them to work. But um, yeah, there's all this. Over here we have the food. Now I've never seen so much food in a mod before in my entire life. And <laughs> the first row here is all different kinds of berries. Gooseberries, blueberries, blackberries. And you can just find these all in your world growing. And I'm pretty sure you can grow them yourself. There's different seeds in that for them. Here's some um, eggplant. Oh, eggplant. Uh, we got some corn, cucumber, broccoli. Who's ever seen broccoli in a mod? Seriously. Lettuce. Different kind of broccoli, I think. Maybe one's cooked, one isn't. And um, as you can see when you go over this, it tells you like what type it is or whatever. Or what you can use it for. Like these hops right here. I'm pretty sure if you use them, yeah, you can make a hot cup of tea. Because yes, there is drinks also. And right down here we have stuffed peppers we have stuffed orange pepper stuffed red pepper over here we have stuffed yellow pepper and basically to make that you just get a stuffed pepper and put it with a potato wait okay that one this one makes a bit more sense you get a pepper and put it with a potato and you get a stuffed pepper that one seems a bit screwed up over here we have kiwi pie you just take kiwi egg sugar and you get kiwi pie um we have we have a tart and a cobbler over here we have all kinds of different soups like Seriously, a lot. Broccoli soup. Wow. Yeah, there's a lot. Oh, what is this? We have cornbread. Eat corn flour, which is from corn. We have strawberries, regular. I think I showed peppers. That potato? No, that is a type of root. What is this thing used for? Oh, a stir fry. You can make stir fries. A lot of different kinds of stir fries, actually. Um, And I think we have peanut butter get peanuts, sugar, and a glass ball and turns into a jar, obviously. And we can use that for you. Make it, of course, peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Delicious. And, um, I would show you all the other stuff, but I think I should do a tour around the world, basically, just to show you guys what kind of, um, other stuff can spawn in that. I mean, I don't want to show you everything. Like I said, I could have put, like, three double chests here, but I, I don't want to ruin the entire mod for you. But, uh, so yeah, as you can see, this is where I spawned. Like, I just spawned here and made this little nice platform thing. But, um, right around me, you can see there's a ton of different plants. Like, right here. Like, what is this? Maiden grass. 
Actually, wait, let me go into survival mode just so I can break some of the stuff. Made in grass right here. So I got made in grass. What's this used for? Green lime dye. So if you want lime dye, you put in your ram recipe and you got lime dye. Bam. Actually, isn't there a sheep nearby? I could have sworn. Yeah, there it is. Sheep, you're now green. Congratulations. Okay, what do we have over here? We have a prairie grass. Oh, prairie grass. Okay. And using this, again with the lime dye, let me, oh, I can replant it, see? Break, replant. So, your garden now, guys, like, you used to just have the regular flowers of Minecraft. I mean, they did with 1.7, add a few more, but still, kind of boring. But now, you can just walk out in the forest and you find this Mary Bell right here, and you take this Mary Bell and you can just replant it, and it looks like it grows. Wait, what can I do with this? Oh, yellow dye. So, yeah, there's infinitely new ways to get all the different dyes, and now, what, what is this? Fairy slipper. What can I use this for? Purple dye. It seems when I replace it, it's like half grown again, so you can grow all these. Um, oh, yes, there are plants that can grow in the water, too. Like right here, we have duckweed. What can I. Oh, lime dye. So let me see if I can replant this. Yeah, I can replant it in. Zombie, leave me alone. I should probably turn it to peaceful. Just, just since it's nighttime. But, um. What else we got? Is this regular grass? Yeah, it's regular grass. We have some mushrooms here, so if I break this mushroom, what can I use this for? I can make mushroom powder, and I use that to make fertilizer, which I assume if you put that on the plants, it'll make them grow quicker, like bone meal. Um, what else do we have? Well, let me go into the savanna. There's not much in the savanna anyway, but it looks like there is now, like these blue flowers. What is this? A pale yaka. Yaka. Can make cyan dye. Okay. <laughs> oh, we got some cows over here. Yeah, it doesn't add any new like mobs or blocks. I guess. I guess well, I guess you could say blocks, but um, not really like a huge variation in terms of that. But like in terms of like plant life, there is just everything. Is this growing on here? Wait, is it? Yeah, it is. Yeah. So the different plants can grow on trees also, like in different mushrooms. Now, what can I? Oh, this is to make the berries. So I can actually make berries with this one. Um, what else we got? I want to see if there's di something different here. Let me go into creative again. I want to find like some huge area. I remember I need to find the ocean, which I think is right here. Because whenever I was looking earlier in the ocean, there was like a ton of plants underwater. Let me see. Go down here. Yep, yep. As you can see, down here on the ocean floor, there is Tangle, whatever this is, and you. This actually doesn't have a use server. You can't even use this thing with anything. Okay. What else? You got kelp, giant green kelp. What can you use this for? Oh, you can make seaweed wrap, and to use that, you can make type of food. Oh, it says a water. Oh, these are like different potion effects you can make with this and like I guess you can eat them cool what else oh this this is a nice patch right here of different plants we got elegant coral oh these are coral wait coral coral I use this for oh this is how you make the um that water breathing wrap it says last for 30 seconds you make arrows with it okay cool in the swamp, as you can see, there's a ton of duckweed. <laughs> um, yeah, there's a ton of... Oh, this one's growing off the tree up here. What is this? Japanese ivy. Let's see what you can use this for. You can make Japanese ivy. Oh, okay. <laughs> or dye. So I guess this grows like a vine. Um, oh, was that a mushroom? No type of cactus. Oh, what is this thing? We have a silver vine creeper. Oh, this is that creeper thing I showed before, but um, you can make it into red dye here. Let me see if I can put this on the mushroom. Yeah, you can. Um, we got some chanterella, chanterelle, however you pronounce that. But, um, looks like I'm going to wrap up this mod showcase, guys. It's a mod that adds in ton of different plants like 200 different plants into your world so so you could adventure out and try to get all the different pa plants i've tried 
I've tried it myself and I couldn't really get that many. There's just so many and the variety is so much. Mod Creator really did a good job on this mod, I can t tell you what. Spent a lot of time doing this. And, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this mod showcase. Please leave a like and if you did. And if you don't like playing it whatsoever, you don't have to like it. And, um, please subscribe to my channel for more content like this. And I will see you guys next time.